security? Neighbours, mate, I've seen it. You won't believe what I'm talking to. It's Jim. Jim from that Hey, Neighbours. What's your first car? Oh, a Citroen Light 15. Uh, we're just five minutes away from the hoops here on four. First time for a spot of fishing with making it. It's 20 years of trying to find the time, find the money. Yeah. It's good to finally pull it off to risk losing it all there will be problems there will be arguments it'll be like a marriage but uh, you can't do anything about it to always go the extra mile this is good honest physical work just like they used to make it to pursue your dreams <laughs> i've always wanted to do something like this i've always dreamed about it that is life's grandest design I kind of got as far as page four <laughs> now that's going to be a little yeah. my feeling is that this is something of a fairy tale adventure for you both fantastic this building deserves to be great this is where it's starts to get interesting. The brand new series of Grand Designs starts next Wednesday at 9 on 4. Celebrity BBLB 655 this morning after double hoops. Tasty. Television chef Hugh Fernley Whittingstall is calling for a mass revolt by Tesco shareholders over its sales of cheap factory farm chickens. Hugh is back in the ring. We don't feel our customers should feel guilty about buying standard chicken. And he's fighting the retail Goliath from the inside. I think I've got a Tesco share, which means I have a say in how they run the company. I'm looking for 100 shareholders to sign the resolution. The resolution isn't going to happen unless I get 86,000. If we don't get the money by Wednesday, we're kind of dead in the water. It's Hugh plucky enough to give Tesco a roasting. I expect Tesco don't think we can do it. Chickens, Hugh and Tesco. Let's go to part of the great British food fight season, Monday at 9 on 4. Supermarkets continue to make huge profits as consumers buy more own brand products. On the packaging corner of the supermarket pipe, there is something called beef connective tissue listed. But is this our best way to save money and eat well? The next stage, we inject the breast. So you think you're actually getting much more for your money if you didn't know that it actually been pumped up with water. Dispatches investigates how, for a small cost, you can dramatically increase nutritional value. How much meat is there in there now? We were at 40%. It's now 54%. The true cost of cheap food. Part of the Great British Food Fight, Thursday at 8 on 4. Jody Fayed spent his last days with Diana. A woman that was putting him on the cover of every British tabloid every day. But he spent his nights with this woman. Definitely had the uh, attraction to the blonde female. A man at the center of a high-profile love triangle. Jody never got a chance to really break out. But what did he really want? And who was pulling his strings? I think with his dad controlling everything, it's going to be very difficult. Jack Peretti investigates Jody L. Fayed. Meeting those who knew him well. From time to time, there was some heavy things on his mind. Dodie, what really happened? Thursday at 10 on 4. It's Big Brother the movie in just an hour after Michelle Heaton drops by in BBLB. Whatever day you've had, have a great night's sleep. Dreams, Britain's favourite bed specialist. 